My name is Fred and in this video number 16 I will look into how to make drawings in the 3D possibility. When you talk 3D you also talk the beta version of Geograbba, the beta version 5. First I want to make two points and the line between those two points. So I make the point A <coughs> and now it's capital A as it is a point 2 comma 1 comma 1 that is and b equal to point 1 comma 3 comma 1 the line between them line a b that is i could turn the graphics window this is the line different viewpoints okay now we want to make a plane through three points. And I could do the same way, making the three points, or I could do it directly, the plane through three points. The first one being two, comma two, comma zero. Now I won't be able to see the three points, but in this case it doesn't matter. Three comma two comma one. And the last point. 1 comma 3 comma 1. And here I got it. And again, I can make some turns to see what happens. Now I don't want to see the points anymore. And the reason for that is I want to find the intersection. And the two things I want to intersect, that is the line named A and the plane named B. So I put down A and B and here is the intersection point. It is the same as the point B but I knew that. And again I could turn it around to see that it is on the line. Yes. And it is on the plane. Yes. If you can't see it I could make it a different color and I could make it a little bit larger. Now it's very clear where it is. I'll hide it again. Now I want to make a sphere with center in C and radius 1. So I'll make it. The point being 2 comma 2 comma 1 and radius 1. Now I've got it. I could hide the other ones the line and the plane. I could make the center point whatever I name it and it is 2 comma 2 comma 1 well, I did it with small letters. I didn't want that. I'll do the capital letter first, center of the sphere is equal to two comma two comma one. And there I can see it. And when I turn it, I'll see that center is always in the middle. I didn't want to see that. But I want, well, I want to see the sphere, but not the center. But I do want the line to be shown now. And here I've got the line. And I want the intersections between the line and the sphere. So, intersect. And the first object being the line, named A. The second one being the sphere, named C and here are the intersection points and again I could color them in different fashions it could be blue and it could be a bit larger so I could see them and here is the one on the one side and here comes the one on the other side if I wanted to I could enlarge the whole thing a little bit but then I should be care very careful 
because it could be so large that I really can't see what's happening. But let me try it anyhow. Let me zoom in a little. So I'll zoom here. Turn it around. But now you can see because of my box I can can't see the entire CNN any anymore. So I'll zoom the other way around. Now I don't want to see the line and I don't want to see those two points. So now they're hidden. But I want to see the plane. And I want the intersection between the plane and the sphere. So again I will intersect. And now the object is R, B and C. And the intersection here is a circle. I could again maybe make it a little bit thicker. Now it's clear that, that it is a circle. This is a beta version and this is one thing they have not yet managed to make. It says up here to do. So we don't get the formula for this circle. And this ends up number 16 of the videos.